briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1995, the Supreme Court of Nevada heard the case of Dutt v. Kremp, which centered on the concept of malicious prosecution and whether a person can be found guilty if a reasonable attorney would have believed that filing the complaint was legally acceptable based on the objective standard of probable cause. Attorney Virgil Dutt had represented his client, Jack Rentnelli, in a malpractice action against physicians who treated Rentnelli for tuberculous meningitis and hydrocephalus at a local hospital in 1985. Despite Rentnelli later voluntarily dismissing the malpractice action, the physicians alleged malicious prosecution and abuse of process against both Dutt and Rentnelli. The district court dismissed the action against Rentnelli, but the case against Dutt went to trial. Dutt appealed the jury's verdict against him, challenging whether the court or the jury should have decided certain issues and questioning the sufficiency of evidence to support the verdict. The central issue in this case was whether Dutt had probable cause to file the malpractice action. The physicians claimed that he lacked probable cause and disputed Rentnelli's son's testimony that Rentnelli's condition deteriorated after treatment. Ultimately, the Supreme Court of Nevada concluded that Dutt had probable cause to file the malpractice action against the physicians, with no ulterior motive. The court reversed the judgment and remanded the case to the district court for a judgment in Dutt's favor. As a result, the physician's cross-appeal was rendered moot. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.